got breaking new details this morning about the crash that led to the death of upstate police officer Jason Harris. He crashed his motorcycle Tuesday night on Union Street. Late last night, Spartanburg police told us moments before that wreck, other officers had responded to a burglary on Cedar Springs Road and called for backup. Harris was on his way to that scene when he crashed. He was taken to the hospital with serious injuries and died yesterday. Rochelle Spence is live in Spartanburg this morning where a memorial has been set up in his honor. Rochelle. Tracy, this memorial was just set up overnight, but it's already become so beautiful. You can see a patrol car here in front of the police department and city hall as well. People are stopping by. They're leaving flowers, stuffed animals. There's also a thin blue line flag right on the hood of this patrol car, and we've seen countless brothers and sisters in law enforcement come and sign that flag. You take a look at the scene here from Tuesday night. This is on Union Street. We've learned from the Spartanburg Police Department that other officers officers were responding, as you said, and so troopers have told us that Harris hit the back right side of another vehicle. That woman also had to be taken to the hospital, but here where we are, people were hugging. They were embracing one another last night as they found out that he passed after three days of being at Spartanburg Regional. Something else that we've learned from the chief here, Officer Harris is leaving behind a wife, three children, and he would have very soon been celebrating his 12-year anniversary here with the police department. We are live in Spartanburg. Rochelle Spence, 7 News. Rochelle, thank you. The blood drive in honor of Jason Harris is still happening today. If you'd like to show your support, it's at Spartanburg City Hall from 8 this morning until 1. Other area law enforcement also showing their support for Harris and his family. The Spartanburg County Sheriff's Office and Sheriff Chuck Wright sent their condolences on Facebook saying, quote, your sacrifice will never be forgotten. The Greenville Police Department posting a picture of Harris on its Facebook page with the hashtags Jason Harris and Spartanburg PD. While Officer Harris was in the hospital being treated for his serious injuries, he received at least 50 units of blood for transfusions. And again, as we just mentioned, that blood drive is still happening today to help other future victims who might need it as well.